so much um, yeah. for cool. your time for speaking to Dura, the Dundee University uh, Arts web, um, web page. And also, um, I think this is very appropriate. We're here in the Discovery Centre by the Discovery, which of course went out into Antarctica from here. And mm. there is your building mm -hmm. going, taking Scottish design and from all over the world mm -hmm. out mm -hmm. into the global sea. Mm -hmm. um, across the sea, so it's a very good place to be talking mm, to you, and thank you, thank you for your time. So what I'd like to talk to you about today is about the process of architecture, imagination, how you mm. go from the blank page mm -hmm. to, to what we have, this mm. magnificent building mm. here, and also about apertures and spaces, but mm. is that okay? Okay. Okay. Um, so first of all, when you first heard about this competition, um, you'd been to Scotland several times yeah. already. Yeah. So could you talk me through the process of, especially the imaginative process of how you came up with, with this design? Yeah, so, uh, so mm, uh, when I saw the competition for the first time, uh, uh, as I was so excited because the location is very, very unique. It is between the land and the waters. It's a very unusual location. And also, we were saying to have the building, some part of the building can be in the waters. And it's very unique. And I think it's worth to challenge. And, uh, and also, the, I, uh, the, I've been in Scotland before. I've, I've been in Scotland before uh, because I'm a big fan of Charles Rene Macintosh. The, when I, I was a student, I, uh, his, his book was published in the, in the 1970s. It a, a kind of revival of Charles Rene Macintosh that happened in the 1970s. And, uh, and uh, when I saw his design, the, as I, I was so surprised to see the, the similarity with Japanese design, the big influence of Japanese design. And, uh, and uh, I myself was very much influenced by him. And uh, I began to think the Scotland and the Japan has uh, had, have some the common background. So, uh, as, uh, it's, it, it is um, simply saying it's a uh, relation with nature and love for nature as a, as a basis of those two cultures. And then the, I, I, I wanted to do the challenge, and we submitted this idea. And uh, the luckily, as, a, as, a, as a we could win the competition. And, uh, and after, after eight years, the, 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 the sun, we, we solved many high hurdle. Because the building itself is a very challenging project, and hurdle is not low, but it's worth to try, and, uh, and I'm very happy finally. So, what were some of those hurdles that you mm. faced, and was it to do with materials, the site? Yes, as a, a, a far, a, a far as the site is a challenge, is because wind is strong, as so the flow of water is strong, and uh, and uh, and uh, sometimes there's a risk of flood, and, uh, and uh, th those kind of risks, as uh, we should solve, and uh, and structurally, it, as uh, we need, as uh, much stronger than normal building, and uh, and uh, and it reflects cost, of course, and uh, then we should solve. The those things. So, when you're coming up with an idea for mm. a competition, how do you go about it? Do you make lots of sketches? Do you what? What's your process? Yes, as a, as a first, as a as a as a process is thinking about the 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 image of the building. As a as a more than as a planning before planning, we should think about. There's a rough atmosphere of the building, and uh, the, the first the, the image I, as I got is the simple box 
simple simple box as uh, so with the cape as uh, in the center and uh, so as uh, mm, uh, because as it is uh, it is between water river and land and uh, it should be the gate which draw people to nature that is my first idea and uh, in some other buildings as uh, i try that kind of cut as, uh, in my hiroshige museum mm, uh, one of my favorite project is uh, as a, as a, as a simple volume as a, as a cut in the center as a, as a, to draw people to the mountain. As a, and as a, as a, by having the cut, as a, people can work as a magnet. And then the, uh, it is my first as a image. And also uh, I want to make building as landform as, a, as a, because it is it is as, a, as a sitting on the in the waters, and uh, that means uh, uh, it should be something like uh, a sea cliff. The sea cliff is is a, is, a, is between water and land, and that is a, as an organic shape, as a uh, as a, is the best way to integrate nature as a water and land. And uh, and uh, a sea cliff like building with a, a cut the hole in the center is my first rough image, and uh, and as a so we uh, as a my, my, the competition team uh, to the competition team I spoke about that image, and uh, and then as a, and the next step is as a, each as a team members as. A, as a as a prepare the some models, and uh, as a and as a as a competition team, as so maybe as a seven eight those kinds of members, and as all members as a as a prepare the as a, as a model, that is as our method. Is a uh, if as a, I draw the the uh, sketch, as a as a, the team members. As a cannot go beyond, as, and then I think as a, that, that kind of as a one way design method uh, is not so creative. As a, we work, we think together, we work together to as a, create something new. Is my approach, and then as a, the, the, the every members as a, as a, uh, prepare something, and there's a base on those. As a first as, as a models, as a, we are talking to each other, and uh, and always in the in the meeting, as a, we prepare as models, yeah. because models is as a, is can evoke our imagination, and the, the rendering mm, is is not so mm, evoking as, as imagination, and. Uh, it's, 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 it's a, a rendering is maybe is a good way to persuade client, to persuade people, but as an internal discussion, uh, the model is, is, is very, very helpful. Still the best way. Physical model is the best way yeah. to... Uh, is a, is and it's a, a three-dimensional. Three-dimensional. And then the weekend, as a, the we can check the view from every angles, and uh, so if we compare the model in the same scale, as a, as a, we, so we can check the impact to neighbors easily. The rendering cannot show the impact to neighbors. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I'm interested in how you talk about architecture. Mm. This notion of gaps and apertures in particular mm. is holding the truth of, mm. uh, of the building and that the bigger the building, the more of these, these gaps or apertures there should be. Could you... Perhaps talk a bit yes, about that. yes. As a, uh, mm, as a, for me, as a, uh, as a, as a architecture should merge to environment, and then as a, as a, and then as a, as, a, as a, we try to avoid the solid wall as possible as we can, and the solid as a heavy wall re, as reject relationship. And uh, then so we try to create a kind of uh, as a 
uh, the particles and, uh, the, and the, between the particles we can have some apertures uh, and uh, to invite people and creating the shadows and uh, that kind of the, the effect as, a, as we can get from particles. And the shadow between the particles is very important. The color of the shadow, the color of the shadow mm, make building the mm, as a more humble, that mean I think the humble. The, the, the wall, straight wall without shadows is shining and it's rejecting. And, uh, and I think shadow make us as a, as a, as calm and uh, and um, this may basically maybe it's related with the the history of human that we were living in the forest and we are living with the shadow of the forest and uh, we were living with shadows for a long long time. And then there's a big shadow gap between the, the particles is most comfortable element for architecture. And, uh, and, uh, and uh, so this building is a, is a, it's not a small building, but as a, as a, as a the to total atmosphere of the building, if we look at that building from bleach, the building is merging into the townscape because of that shadow. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And you have these wonderful things called sun pipes coming yes. down. That's to help with light, the sun yes, pipes. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, yes. The sun pipes is also uh, similar to the, uh, the atmosphere of the, the forest. Uh, so in Japanese, we call it the komorebi. Komorebi, komorebi, is, is komorebi means uh, uh, as a filtered light filtered natural light through leaves and trunks, leaves and branches. And yeah. uh, it is as a difficult to translate to English. Mm -hmm. as a, some as a people translate it, komorebi, to dappled. Oh, dappled. Dappled. Mm -hmm. But dappled is a not so natural. Right? <laughs> yes, Sim similar, yes, it's a similar thing as so, the so. light coming in, but not all at once, being uh -huh. interrupted. Uh -huh. Yeah. But we want to create a kind of dappled effect, yeah. and then the the uh, that see uh, what uh, see uh, what you call is that a glass. Uh, uh, the cupola, the glass. And uh, and this is one of the device, and another is a small windows, many many oh, yes. small windows. Small windows. Um, to create dappled effect. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And um, what what about? You also talk about streets and promenades, which I think you were mm. influenced by Corbusier. Mm. So this whole idea, whole idea of um, framing as well. Mm. Um, I'm interested in that because we, we're now in a video age where everything is filmed and, mm. and, and moving. Um, how do you think that influence has changed architecture? Uh, the, um, as a, as a, as a, as a, he is uh, mentioned about the vertical street. Yes. Mm, Can you explain but, what that is, the vertical street? Yeah, vertical street is a, as a, in his as a United Habitation project, is as a, he, he proposed a vertical street. But, uh, but, but actually, the, uh, the, the street he designed for his project is not so alive, uh, not so human. Mm. And, uh, and uh, as a, I prefer the idea of street by Americans, uh, as a journalist, as a uh, decent life of American cities, uh, Jane, 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 Jane Jacobs. Jane Jacobs, so she has um, as you pointed out about the, uh, the importance of the street life, and uh, and she denies the idea of Le Corbusier, the criticism he criticizes Le Corbusier, so, so. and the complexities so, so, and uh, so some kind of noise is is necessary for street, she, she said, as so, I totally agree with her idea, 
and some kind of the complexities and the, the, and the roughness, the noise is a very necessary for street life. And as a, as a, my design for the big the main space, main why for the, the A, as we try to create a, some kind of noise, as the wooden panels is, is not straight. It's a little bit as a, as a and a waving and, a, and a shaking, and, a, and a, each gap has a dis, different. And a, and also wood itself is a, is. Is, 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 is has not same grain, is a, some diversity, is a, some kind of noise exists naturally in the no, in the wood, and then the, as a, as a, I I I, I, I call this space a living loom in the city, but a living loom is a, also same idea as street. It's it's very alive, and uh, some natural noise exists in the space. And it forms quite a large space in this yes. building, doesn't it? This yes. Ca almost cave womb-like <coughs> space. Yes, it's as a, and a, as a normal museum that didn't have that kind of big space. Mm -hmm. Entrance, and, and, but the, as a, as a, the floor area of that big space is, 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 a, is not so huge, but People feel like big space. I'm living in the big space because of the angle. Mm -hmm. The floor is that, but it's a, the it's a wall is inclined like that, and total space feels very big. As, a, mm, as some kind of flexibility, mm. as a as a, as a give us a feeling of, of playful space, and that as a. The geometry of this museum is very, mm, very not so static. It is a twist, some twisted, and many freedom exists in the planning. And um, and and a, a good imagination from landscape, landscape, and, a, uh, and the geometry of landscape is very free mm -hmm. and very flexible. And, um, and the sea cliff is also that kind of flexibility. And cape in the center of the building also creates that kind of flexibility. Uh, and that topo natural topography is very flexible. It's very playful. Mm. And, um, and then the kids enjoy that kind of topo topography. But square space, vertical wall, uh, the kills that kind of playfulness. And this building contains much of playfulness because of that loose geometry. Yeah, yeah. No, I think you've spoken before <coughs> um, about how many public spaces are almost repulsive because they have these very straight walls mm. and roofs. And, and I think in some of your buildings, you've almost deconstructed the ideas of walls and roofs. Like in Granada, for instance, it's almost like you've got inside out. Yes. Rooms. Yes, yes. So, are you always pushing or challenging conventional ways of building and seeing yes. structures? Yes, yes. And, um, and the conventional building, uh, as, um, uh, especially the conventional as a box building in 20th century, uh, it was not human at all. So it defines the, so, 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 so defines us very strictly by vertical wall and horizontal floors, and uh, it's, it's, it's not playful at all. And instead, I I try to create some continuous topographies, so, and, uh, and, uh, and the and the and the kids. Really like that kind of space. Mm. So it's almost like a building as a landscape. Yes. As it as it were. Yes, as a, okay. as a, that building is as a looks like a landscape from outside, also feel landscape inside. Yes, I think you said it's hard on the outside but soft. Yeah. On, on the inside. Yes. yes, and you can see it in the walls when you're up close. They're not 
straight lines there. There's a beautiful yes, curve activity. Mm. and undulation mm, undulation go, going mm. around. How difficult is that to actually physically make out of things like yes, that? Yes, it's uh, actually it's not so easy to create as a create that kind of natural undulation. Okay. And uh, and and uh, and we as a as a one as a, as a, as a, uh, one secret is as a, that particles and uh, as a particles and uh, and uh, as a particles as a, has gap and that that gap is a, is a make this building is a natural and uh, it's same as as a painting of impressionism. And the impressionism paintings, they are using the particles, and there's a between the particles always a gap, and then the people feel those paintings, ah, not very natural, and uh, if the, they didn't use particles, the as the impression impressionism cannot achieve that kind of uh, natural feeling. Yes, it's a bit like the difference between digital and analog sound. Yes. And 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 in and, 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 and music, it's the it's the silences or the spaces that could be yes. caused for reflection. So yeah. is it the same in a building? Yes, yeah, same as a building. That that you need these gaps are almost yeah. essential, really, aren't they? Yes, yes, and also in Japan, in Japan, in Japanese, as we call this gap, ma, ma m a. Oh. Ma means a space between particles, and uh, in the music, the as 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 si silence between note also called ma. Oh, and uh, and uh, in Japanese culture, as a ma is more important than as, as particles. The notes, either side. The note. <laughs> yeah. Is that true for yeah, your yeah. architecture? The gaps are more important. Yes, more important. Um, and you've also spoken about a hierarchy of apertures and, and gaps. Could you mm. could you explain a bit more of what that hierarchy is? Uh, yeah, as a hierarchy, mm, as a as a, I I'm very mm, uh, as I try to be sensitive to the size as a as of, of as a, as a particles and the gap, and uh, as a higher, more, higher, more than hierarchy is as, um, I, bought, I like the word rhythm. Rhythm. It's a rhythm. As a music, as a rhythm is most important. If we can find a good rhythm, and then naturally, comfortable music. Music is comfortable. Yeah, and it's the same with architecture. Yes, it has to have a bit of a yes I try to as a compose something. Yes, I try to be a mu musician <laughs> with material. Material, yes. Yes, oh, that's very interesting. Uh, okay, <laughs> can I just ask you one final question about Rennie Macintosh? What is it about his style that appealed to you? Yes, as a uh, uh, 1970s, as I as, as I found his book as a. And, and uh, I was so surprised to see the similarity with Japanese design, and uh, and uh, and, uh, and, uh, and, uh, and, uh, and uh, especially his water paint, as a, as a, and uh, he's, he's trying to create some kind of layers of space. It's very impressive, and uh, and. In Japanese painting and Japanese woodblock, ukiyo-e, the layers of space is most important part, important method. Yeah. And also my architectures, the particles is, 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 is to create layers, city layers. And, uh, and, and also his furniture, I, I, we can find some layers, layers of the screen, and the behind the screen, some another layers exist. And the in oak room, there's, a, there's also the screens creating the layers, series of layers. Yeah. When you talk about buildings, you talk about art, uh, music. Yes, and yes. The lot of the way you explain yes, yes. how you work is yeah. in relation to those metaphors yeah. and, and languages and analogies. Yeah, yeah. And I just wondered whether you, th you think in music or you, th 
you, do you think in images when you start, or do you think in other kind of art forms? I think as a, as a, as a, I, I feel there's a strong sympathy to musicians yeah. and music, and uh, and uh, and because I, I I'm interested in the rhythm of particles, yes. and uh, if the rhythm is comfortable, yes. the the architectures as a, can create some kind of as a comfortableness, and uh, and. Uh, and the, the, the rhythm is the basis of my architectural design. Okay. Okay. Yeah, so as a, and, and also the, I got get inspiration from the idea of mo mo modal music, okay. uh, not tonic music. Okay. The, the modal, mo 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 mode, mode. Yeah. yeah, and, the, and the, 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 the modal music, naturally the people are, as a can enjoy the rhythm, like walking.